to partner with Broadcom Foundation to bring you 25 talented young students from 16 countries and territories here to Phoenix. It is so exciting to see young people for whom English is a second language quickly come together around their passions in science and engineering and start talking to each other. I look around and you say a hello by saying Diego. We just say Anyo. Hola. Hello. Konnichiwa. Good day, mate. Yate, welcome to Arizona. The weather is extremely hot here, but beautiful. Jello! It's dry heat here in Malaysia, it's kind of wet. It's hot in Vietnam, you know? Yeah! The 2016 class of Broadcom Masters International Delegates are a really special group, um, multi-talented, so we were really excited to provide opportunities for them to work in teams and really inspire them um, by presenting them with career paths they might not have considered before. I didn't even think that I'd have the chance to go this far. Like It was talked about at school that you could go to US for a project. I'm from a small village and I never thought I'd achieve anything so big. It's just to feel like my heart would jump out of my throat. This is an amazing opportunity to meet so many people from all around the world passionate about science and technology. And it's the one place where you get to meet people who are actually interested in science. Also finding about their culture and countries. Best part is making friendships that will last a lifetime. My favorite part is was when we go to the university and we got the, like a shockwave. To be able to come and actually conduct some experiments there is really an eye opener. My favorite adventure was going to see the musical museum. We saw another boy, Martha, play uh, the piano and he played it so well. It, it was amazing. My favorite part was visiting the Rohide because it was just like the western old town. One of the things that's so important in the Broadcom Masters is that you're learning to communicate your passion, the subtleties of science and engineering in ways that inspire other kids. Broadcom Masters really taught me that we can't just rely on ourselves. We have to learn how to communicate effectively with each other and that way we can solve the big problems in science that we face today. When we did different like STEM activities together, it was interesting because all of us had different specialties in different areas. I would like that other guys from my country live this ex amazing experience. It makes me wonder in what ways I can inspire other kids from Puerto Rico to do the same. You know, to become the next Steve Jobs, to become the next Bill Gates, to go as far as they can. I just really like it when we share our ideas and it really inspires me and encourages me to do more research or more projects later in life. I want to show you my project. The formula for the creatable value. Gluten-free and diabetic people. One kilogram of banana peels can save 5% of gasoline. I believe that other students should aspire to be Broadcom Master Finalists because you get to meet other students who are just as passionate about science. But on, not only that, Broadcom Masters really teaches you how to present your science ideas, which I didn't have that opportunity in classrooms or other activities in science that I've done. You are an inspiration to other young students interested in STEM, and you should be very proud of yourselves and your success so far. Broadcom Masters is about team building. It's about building leadership skills. It's about asking questions. It's ultimately, it's a way to make the world a better place. We're